Kevin Harpum and the bomb he may have made on his remote piece of property is all anyone is talking about from Chawila to Kettle Falls. And people that live in the small towns of Addy and Colville that surround Harpum's property say this is the most intention their small communities have ever received, and most of them are not happy about it. Most, most of us are just regular people, keep to ourselves. People that knew Kevin Harpum say that is why he blended in around the town of Addy. They like their privacy. That's why, that's why we live on such big pieces of property. When I heard his name, I was like, whoa, you got to be kidding me. Harry Zemick lives right across the street from the Addy store, and he says Harpum used to come there about every other night. Just come in and basically, like I said, get a sandwich or gas or something like that and then leave. Just like I said, just like a normal everyday person. Zemick says Harpum was like everybody else in this small town, quiet and reserved. There was nothing unusual about him. I never expected anything like that from him. What is unusual in Addy are the swarms of FBI agents searching Harpum's 10 acre property. The FBI presence has been reduced today and they moved their roadblocks to the base of Cannons Way Road about a half mile from Harpum's house. We saw investigators walking around property close to the road, focusing for a short time on this tree stump. The FBI says they will be up here as long as it takes to get all the evidence they need. While they are here and long after they are gone, the town of Addy will be talking about Kevin Harpum, wondering what we are. Who is he? Never seen him, never talked to him, never, uh, never even discussed him with any of the neighbors because none of the neighbors know him either. <laughs> and what was his real motive for moving to a remote area in northeastern Washington? It was kind of scary. You know, to know somebody's right down the street from you doing that. The FBI is still keeping very quiet about their investigation. I asked them today if they anticipate, ma anticipate making more arrests, and all they said is not today, but this remains a very, very active investigation. Live in Addy, Tori Brunetti, KXLY4 HD News.